Hey guys, Stealth Tiger here, and this is a pretty awesome video I'm here to show you guys today. But before I go ahead and start, if um you can tell anything, if you can notice anything different about my voice and how I sound, it's because I'm now using my Total Beaches to do my voice, and I'm gonna do it for pretty much all the PC games. I don't know how to do it yet for Xbox. I'm still working on it, and yeah. So this is a pretty big video. Um. For Grand Theft Auto fans and for the franchise, these are the brand new screenshots that have been revealed by Rockstar um, for Grand Theft Auto 5. There are 10 new screenshots here, and they're all really diverse and really cool. We're going to go through them all one by one and show you guys them. So, as you can tell right now, this is the first screenshot. I'm guessing it's the main character behind a pretty luxurious car. And the area he's in, it doesn't look like a very high wealth area. Seems like one of those downtown low wealth areas, something like that. Uh, the next one here is, hold on a second, yeah the next one here is a guy, he's sky, I'm guessing it's the main character again, he's skydiving out of a plane into um, from the clouds, so you can skydive in this game, I'm pretty sure, as you can tell from here, which is pretty awesome. Um, it'll be awesome to see the landscape from a point of view like that. The next one here is, I'm guessing, the main character again, he is in a, he's on a motorbike, seems like he's in the desert area um, with the big landscape behind him. He has police cars, I'm guessing, back there and he's got, or maybe just other random cars there. And it's got people hanging out of cars, so I don't know if that's a feature that you can do in the game, how you can hang out of cars and shoot. That would be a pretty awesome feature. And uh, you can tell that this is in the desert area. The next one here is pretty awesome. It's um, a person who is underwater with a, a diving suit on. I'm guessing you can scuba dive in this game. I don't know if it's just part of a mission or it's an actual feature you can do in this game, but it's really awesome how you can go underwater and see the um, the features underwater. Right now it looks pretty awesome, but this is this is good so far. I'm like I'm like I like how you can go underwater in this game. It's gonna make a whole new element into the game. The new one here is pretty awesome because, as you can see, there um, there's a crane on top of a building there. So I'm not sure in, if in this game you can, um, there's going to be actual buildings building around you at real time, which would be pretty epic instead of just the same buildings all around and you know not doing any difference to them. This could also mean destructible environment, which could be really awesome. Like you could actually destroy houses, and you know things like that and they could just be built up again. I don't know, that might be seem a little too far fetched, but that would be a really cool idea. Also, um, I'm not sure if that would be the tallest building in the game. It doesn't look like it, it's that tall, but that that could also have an idea. The next one here is pretty awesome. It's a guy, um, not sure who it is, but he's got a minigun and he's just absolutely tearing up. I, I don't think that's a police car behind him, I think it's just a random car, but it's set on fire and He's just absolutely tearing up with the minigun. So there will be miniguns in this game as well, which is pretty neat. The next one here is a beautiful landscape view, as you can see. I'm pretty sure that's an amphitheater over there. I don't know if you can actually like watch films over there, but there's an amphitheater over there. Helicopter shining down at... Oh, wait a second. That's an, inter an Infernus, the fastest car in Grand Theft Auto 4. We'll be returning to Grand Theft Auto 5, as you can see, there's a green Infernus over there with the the helicopter, police helicopter shining its light on it. As you can see as well, there's a beautiful landscape there, and it's and that looks that looks like the same tower as the one earlier I was talking about. So I'm not sure if that will be the tallest tower in the game, but yeah. The next one here is a pretty self-explanatory um, photo. You've got the the windmill, not windmills, the wind turbines or whatever they're called behind and there's a lot of them so that'd be pretty cool to like try and fly a helicopter past them without getting it like cut open and there's another pretty um, luxur a luxurious car there I'm not sure if it's been in past Grand Theft Auto games but that's a little insight and this one is pretty awesome as you can see it's along the pier here and there is lightning and stuff so the possibly or pro most likely will be um, different weather currents and all that. So you will have like sunny days and then rainy days and stormy days like this, which there is lightning just cracking down. 
and you know waves just killing the pier there so that'd be pretty cool and the final one here is a gorgeous view of the landscape i mean look at that and there's a bridge cutting both um both sections it reminds me of skyrim this landscape and just look how look how massive the landscape is that's ac that's actually pretty awesome and as you can tell from um all these 10 photos there is a lot of different landscapes and different places in this game so i'm guessing this would be a very very big game as you can tell already with this landscape that that is a long way away and i'm guessing you can go to it if you can that'd be pretty awesome but look how awesome this landscape is i'm, I'm loving this game i'm loving all the screenshots that have been um introduced and revealed so guys if you're excited for grand theft auto 5 leave a like on this video or um Subscribe to my channel if you want more Grand Theft Auto 5 content. I'll upload um, the most recent screenshots or any other Grand Theft Auto 5 news. And yeah, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time.